morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever the fluff you are. Well, good to what is going to be able to catch up with the demolition, but I'm just starting in here because rumour has it this place will become a bit of an entertainment space. So there's going to be like party rooms and like, you know, games areas, like arcade, like possible like arcade machines and things. So that's what's going on in here. There is the possibility of that anyway from what I've heard, but it was the DW Sports for you know, for Latics. As you can see there. And it has been used as one of the areas for uh, Pride as well. Where you've got like a you know, like a rest area and a quiet area and things like that if you wanted to just chill. So I'll just start here and I will then give you a all a pod and then we'll see what's going on on the uh, on the demolition site. So pause. So as you can see, still just as clean over here, and it looks like, from what I can see, that more of the uh, areas where they've been cutting back to the uh, new staircase and everything has been opened up. Still see the bits of metal from uh, where the uh, lift was. That's all clean. Still don't know when the how that's going to get sealed off or whatever. Uh, and you know, looking pretty uh, good, and as you can see, just in the distance there is some uh, diggers over there playing around with the long reach over there so I think I'll head that way and then we'll find out what's down there alright so as you can see here all those diggers down there playing around you still got the uh, like what some people have uh, named the World War 2 bunker there with those diggers there also the long reach is taking a bit of a rest They've definitely been cutting it uh, further back, I'll say that. And uh, obviously got more mounds of rubble and everything else. So this is uh, getting a lot uh, a lot more gone and a lot cleaner as well. It's, it does seem to be being cleaned up a bit more, so. But won't be long, won't be long until uh, once all this rubble's gone, they'll start putting the steels up, possibly, and it'll start, things will start going vertical over this way. Uh, it's weird, it's still weird seeing it all like that, and as you can see, the uh, back of the other parade of shops down there. But it's a bit strange over here. But quick pause. Actually, while I'm walking down that way to the other side, since we've got Taco Bell opening in uh, what is probably going to be a short period of time so when you think about it it's not exactly going to be uh, opening very soon but it will be opening pretty soon not kind of like immediately what other restaurants would you guys like to see? because uh, personally yeah I wouldn't mind a Five Guys but that's getting a little bit old it's like everywhere else is getting Five Guys um, maybe a Wendy's be one of the first places in the north to have a Wendy's then we can get the square patties and then um, I can stick a Baconator in my face and then I can go for the extra large a double Baconator a quad Baconator you know why not go dirty with that hey why not even do something even weirder for the first place in Britain and uh, break the mould and open an Applebee's that would be fun maybe an IHOP crack a barrel <laughs> Waffle House I'm just spitballing here guys, but you know, you might find something interesting. Stick your ideas down below in the comments, because you might actually come up with some ideas I haven't. Hey, maybe even, what, get something that's Wigan centric, like, you know, make a personalised place, you know, like, the pie kitchen, you know, pie dome. I don't know people call that up at the stadium, but, you know, whatever, pieopolis. <laughs> you know, but hey. Enough of me being stupid, let's flip y'all back round so that you can see what's going on in front of me. Now more of that has come down. That is uh, getting scary, scary close now to uh, the top of there. And in areas you can, with the naked eye, see right across. Not sure if you guys will be able to see this on the cam, but just there you can see right into the other wall. 
getting so close to the other side and then if I give you there and lower you down you really can see all the way through to the far end Holy Toledo that's coming down fast more of this is going which is uh, sad and good all at once it's sad to see it all go because as I've said many times I am older than or about the same age as most of the buildings on this plot so 30 odd years ain't all that long and plus well good because it's not actually going to be hanging around in a half demolished state so that's all right you know at least you can't exactly uh, see it all in a mess for years and years and years like some other den sites have been so hopefully this won't end up like the black hole in Preston was where it was demolished for well five maybe even eight years and nothing built on it I know there was Covid during it but still there's no excuse to leave a big dump but hopefully this won't end up like that and they'll, they will be able to put something on it it's a shame seeing it all going and as I have said many times I am going to keep on saying the old market hall is good enough and decent enough size where you can make an indoor arena that's my view Anyway, I will stick you all back on a pause and then we'll see what's going on down the other side. Pause! Let's give you a quick view from down here. Can't really see much going on over here, but as you can see here, we've gone through the wall or the window of what was, uh, was the Morrisons. That was here, it's long since gone. And uh, quite a lot's going on. Uh, but not much has happened down here but it is starting to venture its way down this way and get to here so it won't be long till it's down here anyway back up pause god damn they pulled some more stuff out of this a bit of a crunch up front of that as it was going over lump oh, man this is definitely uh coming along a lot more of this has definitely gone down which uh, oh me oh my that's uh, still become a glorious path but yeah let's uh, give you a slightly better view let's zoom y'all in a little bit as you can see you probably just about see through to the other side and over there is some of the areas where you can probably see all the way through. From where I'm standing, I can see all the way through, but I mean, you could probably see it as well, but not quite as good, but still, there's bits where you can see through there. I'm going the wrong way with the zoom. Won't be long until uh, all that side over there is starting to come down have a look at what's going on on the other bit see if there's any more of that lot that's come down that I couldn't see from there oh, all that there and then got a sprayer over there and uh, wow that canopy has gone that canopy has now gone wow wow indeed It would be nice if we did have some portals here so you guys get a bit of a better view but might just be a bit easier but hey a lot of this has gone down which is uh hecka amazing which considering last week there is still quite a bit of that standing so it won't be long until uh, they're going street side which is uh another scary thought anyway I will put you all back on pause and then we will uh, wrap up street side and then uh, we will take it from there so pause with all the progress that's gone on over there I would say they are not so far from coming through here which is going to be uh, rather interesting because this is uh, going to be another tight space but Seeing the facades that actually match 
go away and then those new facades go up that do not match in the colour patterns in the patination, yes, but in the colour, no it's definitely going to be uh, interesting and then beyond that you'll then uh, see that edifice go up beyond it which I still uh, think is a bit puke ridden but hey, you never know it's all just part of that that will be uh, interesting so give it a couple of weeks and they'll probably start having lads on this side wandering around on the scaff pulling more stuff off of there and then we still have this place which is uh, still shut which I haven't heard any mur murmurings of that maybe a few other people have but I haven't heard any murmurings of what's going on in here I haven't heard any murmurings about what's going on in what was uh, Debenhams as well you know all the murmurings I get is uh, a little bit after people that know things but I've tried to find my ways of uh, hearing about it but then again I'm not all that bothered because uh, I'd rather uh, find out as we all find out rather than take it too far anyway I'm going to sign out so the peace see you star side don't get too annoyed and uh, goodbye <laughs>